Let me show you how the gear case is supposed to work. I will show you with the cover removed from the pump so you can see how the motor turns. When the motor runs on a counterclock direction, the gears inside of the gear case will turn the agitator shaft and the washer will agitate. When the agitation cycle is over, the timer will stop the motor. When the timer runs the motor on a clockwise direction, the neutral drain inside of the gear case is engaged and it will prevent the clutch from turning. This will allow the washer to drain all the water without the basket break and drive to turning. When the washer is empty, the timer will stop the motor for about 5 seconds and when the motor starts again the clutch will start turning and that will turn the basket brake and drive tube. When the basket brake and drive tube turns it will turn the basket drive block and when the basket drive block turns it will turn the spin drum which is attached to it. When the timer stops the motor from running the brake spring applies the brakes and the drum will stop. That was basically what the gear case is supposed to do.